Assalamualaikum. Hi guys. Today we proceed to bank discount. Okay, first look at the introduction. So discount loan is a loan on which the interest and financing charge are deducted from the face amount when the loan is closed. So what you need to know here is T represents the bank discount term. Next, D. So D here, small d, represents bank discount rate given in percentage form. Third, this capital D represents bank discount. Okay, next, capital S here is a future amount, means the amount borrowed. And last one here is capital H, represents proceed amount. So first look at what is the bank discount. So bank discount is computed based on the maturity value, means the amount to be paid. So here, how to calculate bank discount? SDT. Okay, next. Proceed amount. So what is the proceed amount? So proceed amount is the amount received by the borrower means the difference between future amount and bank discount amount. So how to calculate proceed amount? You can use either S minus D or S in bracket 1 minus D T. So here you need to know what is the discount loan. Then bank discount also proceed amount. Let's try to solve first example. Fakiha borrowed RM 10,000 for 3 years at 4.5% bank discount. How much was the proceed amount that Fakiha received from the bank? So here, what is the information given from first example? Okay, the value of S. So what is S? Future amount. So look at here, borrowed RM10,000. So that one is S. Next information here is bank discount rate given in percentage. So D equal to 4.5% convert to decimal 0.045. And last information here is T. So T, bank discount term, 3 years. Okay. So, what is the aim of the question? Need to calculate the proceed amount. So, proceed amount denoted by capital H. So, what is the formula? Here, S minus T or S in bracket 1 minus T T. So, here we can use second formula since we have the value of S, the value of T, and last one is T. Substitute at the end. Final answer equal to 8650. So this one, step by step, how to find the proceed amount. Okay, next we proceed to second example. Is borrowed RM5000 from a bank for 180 days at 8? percent bank discount find the bank discount charge and the amount that is received from the bank so this example you have two different questions to be solved first question here is bank discount charge here second question is the amount that is received from the bank so here, first step, what is the information given? So we have here is the future amount, 5,000. Then the bank discount rate, 8% convert to decimal 0 0.08. And the bank discount term. So here, given the value in this. So using banker's rule concept so given in this 
the denominator here 360 okay so what is the formula first to calculate bank discount so bank discount denoted by capital D and then the amount received denoted by capital H okay first calculate the bank discount substitute as D and T okay at the end the final answer for the bank discount charge equal to RM200. So that one is the answer for the bank discount. Okay, next. What is the amount that is received from the bank? So that one represents proceed amount. So proceed amount, you can use this formula S minus T. So substitute S equal to 5,000. Minus bank discount, therefore, final answer equal to 4800. So, this one step by step how to calculate bank discount amount and then how to calculate proceed amount. Let's proceed to third example. I took a loan to buy his dream car listed at RM104751. If he wants to pay back the loan in 84 months with 3.25% bank discount, find the amount of money he should borrow from the bank. So here, what we need to calculate is the amount of money I should borrow from the bank. Means we need to calculate the future amount denoted by capital S. Okay, how to solve this example? First, list the information given. So, this one. The proceed amount, 104751. Next, 3.25%. That one is bank discount rate. Then, last information here is 84 months. So, 84 months convert to year. So, 84 divided by 12 equal to 7. Okay. Using this formula, what we need to find? S. So, S equal to H over 1 minus DT. Substitute all the information given at the end. The final answer for the amount of money that I sh should borrow from the bank equal to RM135600. So, this one, step by step, how to calculate the future amount okay now example 4 Afia borrowed RM6500 from a bank for 3 years at 4% bank discount if she received RM5980 from the bank find the term of her loan so here we need to calculate the bank discount term. What is the information given? The value of future amount, 6500. Then, bank discount rate, 0 0.04. And last one, the proceed amount, 5980. Okay, then, using this formula, substitute all the values to find the bank discount term. So, at the end, bank discount term equal to 2 years. So, this one, step by step, how to calculate the bank discount term denoted by T. Now, let's try to do these quick chat questions. Three questions. At the end, you may check the answers. Okay guys, that's all about the bank discount. Assalamualaikum and da.